Hello guys, this is Amos Style Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play this song called Better Off by Ariana Grande. So here we go, give you a preview of the awesome chorus section you're going to learn today's lesson. Goes like this, check it out. So melody and chorus first because that's the foundation of all songs and it allows to do the stuff that I did in the uh, second half of the preview. So here we go. Let's get right into it. So um, break it up into four main parts so it's easier to learn. The first part goes like this, right? It starts with the F sharp here, middle C here for reference, so it goes to the F sharp here. So F sharp up to C sharp and then three D sharps, one, two, three, C sharp, B, B, down to G sharp, F sharp up to B. And then F sharp, F sharp, G sharp, B, C sharp, D sharp, up to the F sharp. Yeah, a lot of black notes, so I gotta remember that. Okay, one more time, so it goes like this. F sharp, C sharp, D sharp, D sharp, D sharp, C sharp, B, B, G sharp, F sharp, B. F sharp, F sharp, G sharp, B, C sharp, D sharp, up to F sharp. And that's it for the right hand for the first part. Once you get that left hand, we have four chords here. The four chords are two B major chords, which is B, D sharp, F sharp, so two of them. Followed by two E major chords, which is E, G sharp, B, two of them as well. Okay, so with those four chords in mind, so B major twice, followed by E major twice, the two ends together goes like this. Right hand starts on the F sharp, and then C sharp and B major together. And then the second B and B major together. E major by itself, right continues. D sharp and E major together. And that's it for the first part. One more time, it goes like this. Together. Together. Here. Okay, that's the first part. Something awesome happens for the second part. The second part is actually pretty much exactly the same as the first part. Everything except for the last note on the right hand. Instead of going up to the high F sharp here, you just go back to the C sharp, okay? You can see, I'll tell you exactly you want, okay? So everything else is exactly the same. So 90% of it is the same, like this. Same. Same. After the D sharp here, instead of doing to F sharp, this time goes to C sharp. So after D sharp goes to C sharp. So that's the second part. So you can see the similarities between the two parts, okay? So yeah, let's do it again. So one more time. So second part, exactly the same as the first part, except for the right hand last note changed to C sharp. Okay, like this. C sharp, like that. That's the second part, okay? So back to back, the two parts we've learned so far would be play like this. So you can see, compare the differences as well. Check it out. Pretty simple once we learn that pattern there. Okay, now moving on to the third part. Third part, okay, it goes like this, okay? Here we go. Right hand, it's like a similar first half of that motive. It goes F sharp, C sharp, D sharp, D sharp, D sharp, C sharp, B, B, G sharp, F sharp, to C sharp this time. And then it goes D sharp, B, C sharp. Okay, and that's it for this third part. One more time, so, one more time. So it goes F sharp, C sharp, D sharp, D sharp, D sharp, C sharp, B, B, G sharp, F sharp, to C sharp, D sharp, B, C sharp. Okay, that's it for the third part. Once you get that left hand, we have the same four chords as the first part that you remember. B major twice, B, D sharp, F sharp, two of them. And two E major chords, E, G sharp, B, two of them as well. Okay, so those four chords in mind, so B major twice, followed by E major twice, the two hands together goes like this. Right hand starts on the F sharp, C sharp, and B major together. Second B and B major together. Other C sharp, E major by itself. Right hand continues. Other C sharp, E major by itself. Like that. Okay, one more time. So it goes like this. Together. Together. Here. Here. Okay, so back to back the three parts of blood so far will be played like this. Check it out. So it goes like this. Moving on to 
the fourth and last spot, Ryan goes up to the F sharp, A, D sharp, C sharp, B, C sharp, C sharp, C sharp. F sharp, E, D sharp, C sharp, B, C sharp, C sharp, D sharp, B, C sharp. And that's it for the right hand for this fourth and last part. One more time, so it goes like this. F sharp, E, D sharp, C sharp, B, C sharp, C sharp, C sharp. F sharp, E, D sharp, C sharp, B, C sharp, C sharp, D sharp, B, C sharp. And that's it for the right hand. Once you get that left hand, we have four different chords here. The four chords are two C sharp minor chords, which is C sharp, E, G sharp, so two of them. Followed by two F sharp major chords, which is F sharp, A sharp, C sharp. So two of them as well. So the F sharp major is fully black notes, okay? So remember that. Simple. Okay? So the two C sharp minor chords and two F sharp major chords in mind for this fourth part. The two M together for this fourth part goes like this. Right? It starts with the first five notes. One, two, three, four, five. And then the C sharp and C sharp minor together. And the C sharp minor by itself after that. And the right continues. C sharp and F sharp major together. C sharp and F sharp major together. Okay, one more time, it goes like this. Tikada, hia. Tikada, tikada. Okay, so now, back to back, all four parts will be played like this. Check it out. That's it, okay? And you can repeat that, okay? The original actually sounds like this, the melody and chord version of it, okay? So it's like simple. But if you want to make it more awesome, you can. Left hand, you can do all these other accompaniment patterns. Uh, you can like... I can do a rhythmic pattern, or else you can do like more advanced, like octave and more difficult arpeggio patterns that right hand can harmonize, okay? But like... pretty much it so i hope you enjoyed this lesson if you did make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally i have um, multiple thousands and thousands of these video lessons like these for you to enjoy and learn from and if you're ariana grande enthusiast i've done a lot of song by her as well so go ahead search it up and maybe you can learn your favorite song on my channel here as well okay but anyways yeah uh check out the rest of my um musical content so if you want to learn more piano like lessons from me like um like the more uh, in depth and all this musical theory stuff, how to play by ear, um, how to um, improvise, how to read sheet music, how to play and sing, all those other courses are available on my website, bestpianometer.com is my website, so check it out, link is in the description below for you to check it out, but anyways, that's pretty much it as for now, enjoy time around my channel and see you next time. Thanks for watching. For those who want to learn my methods on how to play any song by ear, grab the free preview of my book. Or just visit my website, bestpianometer.com, for all my other piano mastery courses, sheet music, song requests, and services. All the links are in the description below. See you next time.